Welcome back, friends. It's a very special edition of Atlanta & Company. Tis the season for giving, and we're featuring deserving charities for Georgia Gives Day. Now, our next organization is going the extra mile to help farm animals find forever homes. War Angel Farms Rescue and Rehabilitation is dedicated to saving vulnerable creatures, both big and small. Check out my conversation with owner Casey Montana. Casey, thank you so much for being here. Uh, who is that adorable cutie with you? This is Charlie Brown, and he is a rescue that we saved last year from the slaughter pipeline. Um, and he oh. was very sick when we got him, but now he's actually uh, training to be a therapy pony. Oh my gosh, he is adorable. And let's talk about War Angel Farms Rescue and Rehab. It's such a unique and special place for animals just like Charlie. Talk about your mission and what you do. So we are a 501c3 equine and farm animal rescue. So while we rescue all kinds of animals from tortoises, goats, alpacas, <laughs> cows and horses, and we get them from all situations, from um, abuse situations, owner surrender, what we specialize in, though, is saving horses and donkeys from the slaughter pipeline, uh, just like little Charlie here. Oh, and I hate to ask and find out this number, but I know it's important for those who aren't familiar with this industry. Um, you know, how does it happen that they end up in the kill pens? And do you have a number of how many are affected every year? Yes, ma'am. So there's about 100,000 that go every year. And oh. each week, there's a certain number, and we watch that number. Mm. So uh, what happens is horses end up at auctions for many different reasons, whether their owner brings them there, a family member passes. And at the auction, if a horse sells for under meat price, which is around $2 a pound as of last week, um, the kill buyers buy them, and they take them to a holding lot, which is a kill pen. And a kill pen is pretty much a broker for slaughterhouses because slaughter is illegal in the U.S. So while they're at the holding pens, we have a chance to get them before they ship to Mexico or Canada. And um, it's a really sad industry when they're at the holding pens oh like Charlie. Oh my gosh. His mom passed away there. So we, we try to save what we can. Casey, I had no idea. I bet so many of our viewers didn't know about this either. Um, and I know you mentioned that um, Charlie Brown in particular is going to be used in a therapeutic way. Tell us more about that. Yes, ma'am. So a lot of these rescues, you know, they really, they know that they've been helped. They know that they've been saved and they can help other people. So, you know, Charlie is going to start going to nursing homes and children's hospitals. And that's one therapeutic way. But we also do things like women in children's homes come out and love on the animals. Good. We have community service, which, you know, helps people with addiction or mental health come out and do their hours here and spend time with the animals and really get a glimpse of the farm life and helping these animals go through their rehabilitation process. That is wonderful. It's just a win-win all the way around. And I know people out there that are listening and want to support your organization. They're wanting to know where can we go? How can we help you on this giving day? Yes, ma'am. Um, you can go to our website, which is warangelfarms.com, and it has a lot of information. And the ways that you can help is we do private tours, which is a great way to bring out the family, oh, meet yeah. all the rest. Um, we also love to get monthly sponsorships that really helps the rescue grow and to continue saving as many animals as we can. We also have a coloring book on Amazon, which has all the animals oh. here, farm, which is really great. We do special events, which is a lot of fun. There's a lot of ways to support the rescue that you can see on the website. All right. And I know that you have a very specific goal for Georgia Gives Day, right? So the biggest thing that helps the rescue is getting monthly sponsors. So if we can get at least 50 monthly sponsorships today, whether it be $1 to $100, no amount is too small, we will uh, rescue a horse or donkey from the kill pen this month, um, which is a big task, especially around Christmas with pay prices and everything. But we are ready and we want to do it. If we can get the monthly sponsorships, we will go save as many horses and donkeys as we can. Yes, and uh, please make sure everyone knows that website where they can go. It's warangelfarms.com, and you can also find a lot of our information on social media, Facebook and Instagram. If you want to see adorable pictures, that's where you should go. <laughs> oh, well, you are an angel, Casey. Thank you so much. We appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you for having us. We'd like to thank War Angel Farms Rescue and Rehabilitation for sponsoring that segment.